seen this one before. This is your first time. And it's also on four easy payments. Now, this is from Kilronan Marina Wool. Kilronan is the name of the company. But what I want you to know is that they really put the fashion in Irish sweaters. They do. They take Irish sweaters, in this case, 100% Marina Wool. They make it so fashion forward. And it's something you don't get a chance to see very often. The sale price is $117.84. We also offer it on four monthly payments of less than $30. And it is really a just a cool sweater. Uh, Kiernan Costello, hello, hey, how are you? you? Good to have you here. Thank you. Good to be here. So tell me about your company a little bit, the Kilronan uh, company. Yes. Yeah. Well, the brand name originates from the little village of Kilronan on the Aran Islands. Ah. And of course, the Aran Islands is where all Aran or Irish knitwear are really originated from. Uh -huh. uh, you know, it's, it's a series of three small islands off the coast of uh, the west coast of Ireland. And our company started off 50 years ago in Kilronan with a small little shop. Right. And we still have a presence there. Yeah. And that's where we got the name. And wow. as I say, it's the capital of the Aran Islands, you know, all of 200 people. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Now take a look at this brand new sweater. This is a sweater and we have it in several different colors. This is the mist and the mist is like this gorgeous, soft, um, kind of like an aqua blue would be the best way to describe it. It's not like blue as in navy or anything like that. I would say it's really like an aqua and it's gorgeous called mist brand new. Right. Then we also have this beautiful color called soft gray. There it is in soft gray. Then we also have it in beige and parsnip as we call it. So that has the, the colors of the beige and the parsnip in it. And then the one that I have on is called indigo. And that one mixes indigo with some gray, very denim friendly. And this is priced at four monthly payments of $29 46 cents. So indigo, this one is called beige parsnip, and then we also have the soft gray, and then this one is called the mist. Oh my gosh, these are so gorgeous. Take us from top to bottom. Start at this collar because I've never seen anybody do this before. Yes, and quite unusual for us as well, to be honest. Mm -hmm. You know, we've often had garments with collars, but very rarely have we had a collar, you know, that's quite so generous. Right. And exactly. of course, given the fact as well that the yarn in the garment is 100% merino wool, mm -hmm. of course, it's very soft, you know, for, so in terms of next to skin comfort. Mm -hmm. You know, as you know, not everybody, you know, necessarily likes the feel of regular wool. So of course, that right. is the beauty of the merino. Yeah. And of course, we have it buttoned down as well button down with um, coconut buttons. And then tell me about the design on the sides. So then, um, of course, um, like all Aaron knitwear, we have a number of different stitch patterns. And of course, this is no exception. So for example, pulling down along on both sides of the opening, we have really a very elaborate, um, you know, intricate stitch detail. And in actual fact, it's a, an amalgamation of more than one. So for example, you know, we have a massive big cable here. Sometimes it's a little bit difficult almost to see the wood from the trees. You know, you can look at these things so differently, to be quite honest, but it's a very big cable running down here. And within that cable, we have a diamond detail. And of course, both cables and diamonds are very famous Aaron stitches, and they are both steeped in symbolism. Like for example, the cable, you know, that refers to the fisherman's rope, you know, wishing the wearer safety and good luck in life and indeed when fishing. And uh, likewise, the diamond, you know, that uh, wishes the wearer success and wealth, as you yeah. would imagine. Amazing. Yeah. Look at these pockets. Tell me this, I, I just want to show you the interior of these pockets too. It's very smooth. It's a tighter weave so that when you put your hands in there, you don't catch your fingernails in any that's of right. the weave and yes, all. That's I the like intention. that. Yes. And then even just the, the extra little rib that you have that's at right. the top just of that. Just to give it more structure. Yeah, and yeah. then you come down to the bottom, you have all this ribbing at the bottom. Indeed. And then take a look at the side, even like down the edge, it's like a honeycomb, I, I would say, or um, what would you yes, call it? Yes, that's right. We call it a rice stitch, you know, very similar to the basket stitch. Yeah. You know, and of course, the basket stitch, you know, once again, the people of the Aran Islands, they use their environment for their inspiration. And of course, they're all fisher people, they, you know, fisher folk. And um, of course, the basket we refers to the fisherman's basket, you know, wishing the fisherman, you know, bountiful catches. Wow. Yeah. Okay, I want to show you something. This color is the mist, and I called it more of an aqua, and mine is the indigo. Can you see? See the difference between this blue and that blue? So mine is the indigo. Mine's a regular blue, like towards the navy family. And this is more of an aqua color. It is stunning. They're all stunning. And then, of course, we have the gray, which I'll show you right here. And then we also have the beige with the parsnips. And the reason we say that is because 
it's the beige and the parsnip color is more like a taupe. So you're mixing the beige and the taupe together. Here's the thing is that you can get this home for $29.46. And at the same time, you can get this home and find out how nice it feels, how nice it fits. I mean, now I probably have battery packs and all going on in there, but you can see this is, this is a great length, a beautiful sweater. I could so see living in this sweater, can't you? I mean, really, whether it's with your jeans, whether it's with your trousers, maybe it's gonna be with your leggings, your slim leg pants, anything like that. It really makes such a difference to be able to have a gorgeous sweater like this. We do say dry clean only, but with all the 100% merino wool, you can imagine that it's going to be something you can just air out when you want to. It's more stain resistant. So you get the long sleeves, the button front closure, the two front pockets, and also the collar with that button detail. Just a terrific buy, a wonderful opportunity. And there you can see it, we have it in sizes, extra, extra small through uh, 2X. And we'll be able to see that uh, that's a, a great size range for you too. Let's go back yeah. to the buttons. Tell me about that button a little bit, Kiernan. Yes, that's a coconut Kiernan. button. And you know, very often the buttons that uh, companies might choose wouldn't always necessarily be natural for very practical reasons. But we think the coconut button, you know, works, ext works extremely well with that garment and of course on the collar as well. And we think it blends in very well with each of the four colors. It does. Yeah. I just think it's so fashion forward to be able to have the buttons on the collar. Now those don't, oh, they do unbutton. You could yes, if oh, you absolutely. want to. Yes, that's I thought an it was just stitched on. Oh yeah, no, there. Oh, so you yeah. can actually open that up if you want to. Interesting. Yes. Yeah, because they've made yeah. a buttonhole in the neck. That's right. Oh my gosh, that's a lot yeah. of work. Look at that. So like on a very cold evening, yeah. you can pull that or collar you up around pull your it neck. Up, exactly. You can do that. You can yes. pull up that collar if you want to. And you could almost button them crisscrossed. I was just thinking that'd yes. be kind of cool too. Sure, yeah. If you wanted to do that because yes. you've got the buttonholes on both sides. But then when you bring it down, you want to wear it regular, then just go yeah, ahead and button that up. Yes. These are coconut buttons. They are, yes. How fun. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. here's what I want to just remind you about is that this is one of those sweaters that's nice and long, brand new today. It's a big hot pick. We put it on four monthly easy payments. And this one, not only do you have the traditional Irish 100% merino wool, which is super soft, it does not feel like regular wool. It's just very, very soft. But it also is fashion forward. And that's what I think is so cool because you can be fashionable and be comfortable and have something that's different than anybody else. Now I wanna talk about another thing. I wanna give you colors and then we'll talk about what does plating mean. Indeed. This one is called beige and it's also parsnip. beige parsnip. Then we have the gray in here. Then we also have this one which is called mist and you can see it's more of an yeah. aqua color. And then we have the indigo blue. Okay, indigo blue has limited quantities now if you wanna get that. So I'm gonna put the gray up here. Explain what that plating, P-L-A-I-T is. That's right, Jan. Is. As you would plait your hair, really. I mean, that's, oh, you know, essentially it's the same idea, you I know, where you would mix, you know, I mean, two colors, you know, oh, running one over the other. Oh, there's a few colors in mine. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I wasn't suggesting that, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> and um, so, I mean, the effect, I mean, it's quite an intricate, complex way to knit a garment, mm -hmm. because if you have only the one yarn, uh, as you would normally have. Uh, you don't really have to worry too much about the placing of it, diff different yards, but here you have two distinct colors running one, one into the other. Mm -hmm. And the benefit of that is that um, you can see the stitch detail. You know, we always refer to a three-dimensional effect when you talk about iron this where uh -huh. you know, it brings out the stitch detail that little, bit, that little bit more than it normally would do. Mm -hmm. So for example, I mean, what you have here in each case, you have two distinct colors. And in this case, you have soft gray and gray. And the soft gray is brought to the fore and the darker gray is brought to the back. Yes. And as a result, as I say, it gives far greater distinction to the iron detail. Mm -hmm. Far greater, dis there you can see the lighter comes to the front, the darker goes to the back, but yet there's light and dark on every single area you, you look at. But here, like you see, this is where you see more of the dark. That's right. And so it creates and this the elongated down. line down the center of that sweater. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Yeah. Isn't that gorgeous, ladies? Oh my goodness. So very, very pretty. So I just wanna say, Anne, you've got the gray on, 
and over here tell me your name again I'm Jessica. Sorry. Jessica why couldn't I think of it she has the indigo on which is the same one that I have on so that means I'm gonna go put on the mist okay so I'm gonna go I want to put that mist on anyway I've been waiting all day to wear it but um, this one too when you look at these sweaters when you're trying to decide what kind of sweater to make and design to bring to QVC Karen do you yes. feel like do you have designers that say, hey, what's on the runway? How can we take the traditional Irish and mix it with today's fashions? Yes, very much so. So, I mean, for example, uh, that would apply not only in terms of the pattern, but equally in terms of the color as well. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, in olden times, Aaron knitwear I got it. There was go. pretty much available so solely in the natural color. Mm -hmm. the undyed ecru color nice. and of course as time has evolved we have expanded our offering and of course there's no reason i mean it goes back to the days of you know the likes of henry ford offering his cars you know only in black you know i mean where is the logic in that <laughs> you know why restrict yourself to that right so um you know the colors have as i say have evolved you know with time and uh, we would use a number of different sources for our inspiration Obviously, the core is the basic traditional Aran stitches. Right. But I mean, there's so many different ways that you can configure the stitches. Right. You know, exactly. to give a more modern interpretation. I mean, Aran knitwear is very much a living concept. I mean, it yeah. harks back to our ancient history and our tradition. Uh -huh. But I mean, that said, it's evolving all the time. And I mean, that's really the exciting part of it. That's what we love. I mean, when you think about 26 years we've been bringing Irish products to you for Rose of Tralee, and yet we still are seeing new, exciting things. Every time. This is the mm -hmm. color called Mist. And so this is more of an aqua color. I do want to update you. We started with 1,600 total sweaters. We have fewer than 600 sweaters remaining. The indigo is the most limited. So if what size, do we have all sizes or um, extra, extra small through extra large in the indigo, which is really your denim type of color. Then this is the mist, which is more of an aqua color. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness, it's like a sweater coat. Yeah. And of course, it really it's mixed is. with a bit of gray as well. Yeah. You know, to give that plated look. That's right. And then here's the gray. I'm telling you, this gray is stunning as well. Yeah, very, beautiful. very pretty yeah. if you want that, because you see the highs and the lows and, lows and all of that, and the buttons, the coconut buttons. There you see the back of it. Look at that. I mean, that is like a stained glass window in a cathedral in right. some ways. I oh, mean, yeah, it's in just many respects. Stunning. Yes, indeed. And then also, here you have the beige with the parsnip. the parsnip. I can never remember. My mother used to th throw parsnips in the in the meals sometimes, yes. and as kids, we were never that excited about it. But anyway, okay, but that's a whole other story. <laughs> but it's like, I can't remember what the parsnips look like. You'd okay. think that I would. But this is the beige and the parsnip. We're going to go to the phones. It's Ina from Kentucky. Did I say your name right? Hi, Ina. You sure did. Oh, uh, good. No, Ina. Please say hi to Kieran. Hi, Karen. Hi, How Ina. are you? How are you? Good. Did, did you good. fall in love with the sweater today? Yes, I did. Good. good. Tell uh, me why. I ordered it in the blue. In which one? The mist or the, the no, indigo? indigo? Okay, got gotcha. you in the indigo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. It looks it looks very uh, fitted and it doesn't look bulky. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's just a very nice looking sweater. And yeah. I know it's it's warm. Mm-hmm. It is warm. And yet it's not too warm. I'm telling you, I'm in a warm studio today, hot and sticky and humid. And I'm actually doing quite well. <laughs> So I, I don't see yeah. the beads of sweat over my lips yet, oh. you know, so that's a good thing. Yeah. But that I will say that it's easy to care for. Have you ever had 100% merino wool before? I have. Okay. Um, a long time ago, though, mm -hmm. and uh, I haven't had it since then because I thought it was really, really too hot. Yeah. But this sweater does not look like it would be that way. Yeah, I, I don't think it will be. No, and I, you can wear it as an outdoor sweater coat if you yeah. want and to. And of course, the merino wool as well. I mean, that's one of the beauties of having a natural fiber. Yeah. You know, it is neither, it's fair to say, it's genuinely not too hot or too cold. Right, it you breeds. Know, it, it breeds absolutely. Yeah. So it releases either heat or, you know, um, and likewise keeps mm -hmm. you a little bit warm during the cold weather. Well, Ina, I'm so glad you called, and you just got a chance to meet the man who comes from the company who made it. So I'm glad you got that opportunity. And I'm glad to. I feel very privileged, and yeah. he's made a beautiful sweater, and y'all have a blessed day. And Thank you, you too. Ina. Happy you too, Labor Day weekend. You too. Thank right. you. Bye-bye. So here's what we have left. The indigo is completely gone. We do have the gray right here. We have the mist that I have on, which is a gorgeous aqua and we have the beige. So beige, gray, 
and mist. Those are your colors. Give us a call. We have extra, extra small through 2X, unless some of the color or sizes have sold out. Kieran, Great. thank you okay, so much. Bye, Beautiful pleasure. piece. Thank you indeed. Love it. And we have another sellout for you, and that is the uh, Connemara Mar